Gainesville Artists is rallying kids together to hear them speak about the causes of gun violence in the community. tv 20s Ethan Badowski tells us how they used art to spread their message. Kids came out to the Clarence R. Kelly Center to use art as a means to draw attention to what leaders have called a gun violence crisis in Gainesville. I wish the community was way safer and I hope we could have a better community. The event was titled Peace Up, Guns Down and featured a youth town hall discussing the impact gun violence is having on kids. The event's organizer says she wants to put art on display to show kids there are alternatives to violence. We were born with gifts to be able to heal ourselves, heal our communities, and and I think that we should be able to equip our youth with the tools to be able to do that. And so the arts goes hand in hand with healing and trauma and navigating trauma and violence. Along with the town hall, kids could also participate in painting and other forms of artistic expression. One community activist shared his story of how he says he turned his life around and away from violence in the streets. You had to be a dancer, you had to be a thug, you had to talk you had to be a shooter. That's what we see in the rap generation right now. You gotta be these things to be somebody. But I'm here to tell you that's a lie. No, you don't. You just gotta be yourself. If you wanna be somebody, you ain't gotta be somebody. You already somebody. You be yourself. The event comes just a few weeks after the well-attended gun violence summit was held by Gainesville City leaders. Thomas said while that was a start, the community must continue holding events to draw attention to gun violence. I really do think that the city is trying to make a change, but we really have to work together to keep pouring into the communities that are in need, that are hurting. So far, city leaders have yet to take any legislative action against gun violence that stemmed from the summit. In Gainesville, Ethan Badowski, TV 20 News.